I'm Helle Jongerius. We are in Berlin. Uh, I'm an industrial designer. I lived before in Rotterdam and I've been working there for 15 years. And I had a beautiful house, a studio around the corner, a nice team, good clients all over the world. And it was not inspirational for me. You know, I like to be a starter and I'm good when I'm a starter, when I'm young and new in a field or in a culture. So we wanted to move and looking around, uh, after a while we knew we wanted to be in Europe. So we looked to a few cities and we have decided to go to Berlin because it's a green city. It's a big city, but it feels like a village. But the main thing is, is that it is uh, not about money. So there is not stress of money in the city. It has a relaxed environment. It's not finished, which also makes it still creative and things are moving and there is a young crowd. And it's not a huge design crowd, but I'm, you know, I don't, I'm not interested in have that close to me. I have a very small group of clients, so I really am very picky who I work with because I wanted to have a longer relation with clients and also that you can build together a collection. I work for textiles with my harem in New York, so I do upholsteries. I do three, four, five textiles a year for the American market, but Fordrat is the company that sells it in Europe. And then I do Fitra, I do furniture with them, but I'm also the art director for textiles, colors, surfaces, classics. And then I work for KLM, so I have an aviation part in my portfolio. So we did the business class for the 747 aircraft interior. We did all the soft parts, but also the chair, so it's the full interior. And then I just did the UN lounge in New York for the delegates with the team Krem Kohlhaas, Irma Boom, Louise Schouwenberg and Gabriel Lester. For the Dutch government, we did the interior of the delegate lounge. This will be opened in September. So this is the group of projects that I'm now working on. And, uh, you know, I don't have a hands-on workshop anymore in the studio. I had that before, so a large one. But now that I work with larger companies, I have, like at Vitra, there is a, a huge team who are doing uh, the hands-on work. And, and at my harem they do, and all the mills that I'm working on. So I, I make small models, but I can't, you know, I'm, I'm spoiled because the clients have their own research and development for me. So I can ask them, can you make this model or can you do this fabric or color? So it's a, it's a, it's a huge network and I'm the spider. <laughs>